guys welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is Ashley and if you're turning to subscribe hey what's up so I'm actually on my way to work but today is a nice day today the couch get delivers today while I'm at work so my boyfriend's going to stay at my house to make sure that it's delivered I'm really excited about it can't wait to come home and, and unbox the couch but anyway I'm running late for work it is now 7:23. I should have left 20 minutes ago. So I'm gonna be right on time. Anyway, I see you guys when I get back. Hey y'all, so I'm back from work and I'm also going to the movies, but my couch, I'm going to the movies again. I'm gonna see, I'm gonna see the Thor movie. Hopefully it's good. Cause you know, Thor has been good lately, but like, why are you mixing it with Guardians of the Galaxy? anyway um my couch was delivered today just know that i'm gonna be a diy queen i will be changing the legs on the couch but i did get a sectional it's a small sectional i got this couch from castlery or castlery i say castlery um that's where i got it from and the boxes are pretty big these are the boxes i'm assuming this is the sectional part which will be going right here where this floor is and then right here the couch is not that long um so i'm gonna put it to, uh, together tomorrow yes yeah, so i'm gonna put the couch together tomorrow after work um because i work from home tomorrow but anyways guys i'm gonna see you guys tomorrow when we put this couch together I'm really happy because I could just sit in my living room and watch. TV. Hey guys, so today is Wednesday and ooh, I'm shaking the camera. Today is Wednesday and I'm just getting myself together. It is it's like 12 56. I've been on lunch for like 20 minutes, kind of 20 minutes. Um, and I just came in our room because I have to do laundry and stuff. But before I started laundry, I was like, you know what? I just started a TikTok, which it went. I have one of my like two of my posts that went viral. Um, because I was talking about like how much I pay for rent and how to like apply for housing connect and stuff like that and then someone told me that my bed faces the opposite way which I kind of knew but the way that they did my room it looks like as if my bed is supposed to be on the side that it is on so let me explain excuse the mess because I'm in the process of trying to do laundry so um I moved this dresser over here but there's no walk room and the way that they have this right here with the plug that's supposed to be like internet and um i'm supposed to like plug my tv in there for like internet and stuff like that so i'm assuming this is the side where i'm supposed to have the tv according to people i'm supposed to have my bed facing this way which i have thought about but i already mounted my tv and then um even if i do have my bed face this way where am i gonna put my dresser which mean the dresser would still have to go on the opposite side um it would work but i don't know let me know what you think this is a small walk-in space let me show you it's like boop 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 it's small it's a small walk-in space but it does look nice like with the tv over the dresser and then i have this much room left over but the way that my nightstands are there's plugs behind each nightstand so it looks like it, as if the bed is supposed to be faced that way because there's plugs on each side one of the plugs works with the light switch and the other one doesn't this side of the room um doesn't have double plugs like that so i don't know and then i'm thinking maybe i should just leave the dresser right there and have this little room this little area right here where i can make like a little reading nook or prayer nook anyway let me open the box of my couch and let's get right into that <gasps> i'm so hot so these this box is literally the same height as me it's kind of crazy uno momento said this before but i got this couch like from kristen ashley's instagram i mean instagram youtube she used to live in a studio and then she moved to her own house in connect apartment also in new york but you guys should check her channel out she's i love her content like it's just so nice and fresh she had this sectional couch which was a good size it's like 95 to 96 inches long width wise or long length 
and then the sectional is a little bit shorter so i decided to get a sectional because i know i'm not gonna buy a couch for a long time and i was able to get it on sale for the july 4th sale so i spent 1500 with for it with tax it's normally uh 18 something almost 1900 almost 2000 hours so i got a lot of money off and that's the reason why i got it the other couch that i wanted was a green sectional couch and that was sold out which unfortunately i wasn't able to get so let's get into this let me lay this couch down so i can open it properly this oh my god it looks so nice in person i'm so happy i'm actually happy <laughs> I'm literally sweating. The couch came with this color light, which I don't like. DIY me. We'll be painting these black. Well, I'm going to get spray paint. And um, I am going to get some sandpaper so I can spray paint these matte black. I was going to buy new legs. And I was like, you know what? I'm not going to do that. But I'm not going to put the legs on today. Um, I did get the stuff out of the boxes. It was like a lot of work. I had to stop recording. Um, and I was sweating. And my lunch is almost over but so oh my god it's not doing any justice on camera so i thought it was gonna be that long it's a good size but as soon as i get everything out of here get the legs on i'm gonna show you the full thing but this is the couch i still have room over here and room over there it looks small on camera but it's a good enough room for me to get a small little side table and my lamp to go over here as well once i put the legs on everything will be okay um it is very like the cushions are very soft it's a little firm because it's not worked in yet but yeah my couch is here anyway guys so i'm gonna come back to you guys a little bit later because i want to go to the store to get like the stuff for the legs and stuff like that and then okay so i'm off work not my wig lifting i'm off work i was in my room trying to like switch the bed to the other side to see how like everything will look but it's just not logical for me let me show you guys so this is how it would look right here if it was on this side because i have a nightstand on that side but like this is really really close and that's not gonna work for me it's like the way that the bedroom was made is an awkward way so on this side we have a plug for the nightstand and then on that side was a plug for my nightstand as well on this side there's not plugs that i can plug in a lamp or anything for a nightstand i will be switching it back even though i love the way that this look if i did not have two nightstands then the dresser could have been at the side of my bed and I would have had just one nightstand but I have two yeah this is just not gonna work so it is now what's today Thursday today's Thursday um what time is it it's 8 21 it's later on in the day today was just like a hectic day at work and I had a couple of meetings and then I have a meeting again tomorrow too it was just hectic um but I did go to Home Depot and I got the spray paint I got a flat black instead of it being matte black but it doesn't matter it's still like a flat black color it's not glossy i'm gonna spray the legs um first without sandpaper in it and if i don't need to sandpaper the legs then i will be returning this six dollar sandpaper i don't know why it was that much but i also you know i can't go to the store and not get a plant i'm able to replace i got a new plant she's kind of light skinned We'll show you my plant so uh, this is my new baby i'm so happy about this i'm very happy about this plant so it looks nice and full i'm gonna pull a little bit of the dead leaves off because there is some that is dying which i just want to get out of here i'm just gonna find a box that i can spray paint the legs in and then we're gonna get started on that uh, i'm so tired but anyway i'm rambling let's get into these legs okay so it is now the next day yesterday i tried to do the spray paint but it looks like it's not spraying on top of it it just looks like it's just sliding off and it's not the correct paint so i had to go back to the store to get a new one so that's what i'm about to do right now i'm on my lunch break yeah i'm on a lot of breath i'm on my lunch break i have like 25 minutes left so i'm gonna rush to the store really quick so i can get that and then get back in the house okay so i'm finally off work i tried to 
do two of the legs both of these are almost dry these are just like my test dummy ones and i'm about to do the other legs at the moment so they could be dry for me to put them on the couch tomorrow so i'm going to continue doing that i'm not going to do it with the camera on because i don't want my camera to get dusty but i'll show you the final result <laughs> The legs are finished drying. I sprayed them yesterday. Um, all of them are finished drying. And what I have to do, I have to go back to Home Depot and get some, um, what do you call those? The Velcro thing used to put on the legs so it doesn't scratch the floor. But let me show you what the legs are looking like now. I'm gonna get something to put on the bottom of these so it doesn't scratch the floor and the paint doesn't really rub off on the floor because I did paint these. And then also I gotta put this up. I got a mail and key holder. So I'm going to put this by the door. I got this from Amazon. A little something, something, something there. And they gave you like this little card. So July 4th just passed. So that's the reason why this is in here. But I might just put like a, a photo of myself. Okay. So we got the, the felt. It says heavy duty felt. And then on the back it says I have to sand the bottom. Which I don't know why. Let's see what I'm gonna do. This is what it looks like, but it's not meant to look cute because I don't want it to scratch my floors. I'm gonna put the rest of these on and then we're gonna start. Then we're gonna start doing this. Okay, so according to the instructions, I put it like this. Kick off my shoes. This one good. This one good. Take off this suit. This one good. This one good. It says not to use a drill. I will be using one because how can I screw this on without a drill? I'm gonna take my time, so let's get into it. I gotta put the couch down by myself. This should be interesting. Excuse the mess. Is that slipping? So I'm gonna have to fix that. But this is how the legs look. Instead of it being brown, it's black. I love it. I'm sitting on my couch. My biggest purchase. I didn't have to go to Facebook Marketplace. I mean, nothing's wrong with Facebook Marketplace, but I actually was able to get a brand new couch that I actually love and I'm happy that I got what I wanted. I'm happy. So next up is rugs, paintings, bar cart, a lot of stuff before I can do a full furnished apartment tour. Might do that on my year anniversary of living here. We will see. There's gonna be a lot of other changes like my TV stand, I'm gonna be replacing that because it just gives me cheap vibes. I'm trying to be look luxury, but it's coming from Ikea too. So it's gonna look a little bit more expensive. Well, technically it's gonna be a little bit more expensive, but yeah. So let me show you the full 
the full product. Okay guys, so this is my baby. I don't have any couch pillows or anything yet or my painting. I was gonna put this over the couch, but it kind of messed up, like the white part. I'm gonna get new paintings to put on the wall right here. I'm gonna put a lamp right here with a little basket to cover that. I still have room. I will be changing the TV stand, but I'm able to still get a coffee table if I wanted to, like a small one. I thought it was gonna be too tight, but it really isn't. For myself, this is enough room. I actually like the couch. I'm gonna list it down below in the description okay so i did order this off of amazon it actually fits in my drawer so i measured my drawer and it fit perfectly so i finally got a utensil organizer instead of having it to do this so what i'm gonna do is organize this in here And voila it fits it's just a little bit off which it don't it doesn't need to be very tight in here i'm able to figure out what to do with that i might put that in this drawer to organize the bigger utensil um they did send me a wooden spoon i don't know why but i'll put that in there this is good for yogurt okay so now let's get into this i don't know if i said it in the beginning of this video or the last video but i had like a velcro strip on the wall and it took the wall off so i know now that i would be putting holes in the wall instead of just using these strips because these strips i don't have time to be painting over big ass strips so holes will be going in this wall let me get this thing i don't know if that looks it looks straight to me it looks straight from this angle it looks like it's not straight sweating like crazy moment of truth voila I, I can put my stuff on here right now so my keys are doing perfectly fine okay small little update and then new mail will new mail will go on top of here i will be getting a little entry table right here very soon so we'll see we'll see we'll see we'll see this is the end of this video don't forget to like comment subscribe subscribe to the family i did have a 10,000 subscriber goal it is now july we're not even close to there so let's get to 5,000 by december by december 31st before 2023 but i hope you guys enjoyed this video your girl got her couch now it's time for a little more decorating and putting pieces together. I can't wait. Bye, y'all.